The Walking Dead, issue 46. You shot her in the head. You killed her. Yeah. She was fucking dead, boss. You saw her die. You witnessed it. I feel. Look, she ran away. She got pretty far. I saw her run. I shot her. I saw her fall down. I saw her stop moving. I'm sure it wasn't as slow and painful as you would have liked. But she's dead. And before she got away from us, we took this. Figured you would want the trophy. I don't mind you being out here, but if anyone even thinks they can hear a car, you get Judy inside before anything can happen. Don't worry, I'll protect our little girl. Don't we just take this stuff out of the truck? The truck could be the difference between us living or dying. This is our safety net. Things go bad. We load up into this thing and tear out of here in whatever direction we're not getting attacked from. Being prepared is the smart thing to do, but I'd hate to think you've lost hope, Rick. We can do this. We can beat them. Believe me, Herschel. I hope you're right. Okay, things are looking good. We've set up cars as a barrier. Our escape truck is loaded down with supplies. There are really only a few more things to do. I'd like to get the prison buses out of the garage. We've got two of those things. I'd like to park them next to the towers to provide a little cover for anyone who would want to go to or to get away from the tower. Also, there are only a few right gear suits left. We should really use those. Aside from that, we just need to stay alert. But at the same time, get as much rest as we can until they come back. Because they will be back. I'm gonna go check on Carl. I'm feeling a lot less lightheaded this past hour. I think I can get rid of these crutches. Not yet you can't. You don't need the strain. Could cause you to bust your stitches. You'd be risking infection. It's something I might have to risk. I've already got enough slowing me down. Keys? Yeah, and these too. We need a little bit of everything, if you'll fit. Didn't you already put most of everything in the big truck? Why do we need this stuff? If everything works out, we won't need the truck, or this backpack, but I want to have options. If you and your mother have to get out, and can't get to the truck, you'll need to have this. What about you? Where will you be? Don't worry about me. If we get separated, I'll find you. You promise? I've done it before, haven't I? <laughs> oh yeah. One more thing. What is it? I wanted to give this to you. My gun? I know you'll be responsible with it. I trust you, Carl. You might just need this. I just want you to be careful. Thanks, Dad. I promise I won't. Are you scared? I'm not going to lie to you. I'm worried. And that's why we're being careful, preparing for the worst. But I'm not scared. And I don't want you to be scared either. We can get through this, son. We can. Hmm. Anterior artery is not equipped to handle that much blood flow as circumvented. Good to know. Uh. Yo! Hi, Alice. Patricia, um, I'll come back in a few. I'll come back later. We gotta wear this all day every day from now on? You gotta. It was just a suggestion for everyone else. But you have to. My orders. Fine, fine. I don't want you up in that tower unprotected. It's for your own good. You, um, you've been praying? About us, I mean. Like I've never prayed before. On certain times such as this are what gets you praying the most. It's times like this I thank my lucky stars that the Lord is there for me. Do you think the Lord is there for me too? Of course he is. And don't worry, I put in a good word for you. Dad, I'm, I'm so scared. I know, son. We all are. Oh, there you are. Huh? Oh. Hey, Alice. Uh, uh... It's okay, really? Don't mention it. No, uh, I'm sorry about that. I, I really didn't mean to. It just kind of happened. Patricia and I were talking and, you know, it wasn't about turning anything away at this point. You follow me? Understood, yeah. I just wanted to check on your bandage, make sure there wasn't any excessive bleeding. Seems fine to me. Uh... So, well, what do you think? We're gonna make it out of this? All I'll say is that every hour that passes makes me regret more that I didn't just leave with Dale. What about you? You wish you left? Me? No way. It's been a long time since I've been on the other side of that fence for good. And I know there's nothing out there for me. 
This place is my home. We've got to be quiet, baby girl. Mommy's sleeping. We don't want to have to go walk around again, do we? Good girl. I love you so much, little Judy. Ah! Shit. Truck! I see a truck! Glory, go back inside. Protect the kids. What's going on? We got a truck coming back. It's just one. It's got to be Teresa and Michonne. They wouldn't send just one truck after us. It's got to be them. What are they doing? Are they turning around? Trying to get us to follow them? They're attacking? I heard a shot. What's going on? They're backing the truck towards us. This is weird. Wait, they're getting out of the cab. It's... Let's do this. Keep the fucking biters off us long enough for me to finish, okay? Will do. It's showtime, bro. <sighs> oh, no. Before anyone gets trigger happy, Nova, I've got the woman too. My fat friend here and I don't get back to our camp in one piece, and she dies. So no sudden moves, okay? From that, I think you can see where this is going. Open the gates, get in this truck, and come back with us. Or I do something horrible to your friend. Don't let him in. Don't. Shut up. So what's it gonna be? What do we do? What can we do? We can't let him in here. He gets in the prison, he'll kill us all. Eventually, Horace never should have left. It's him, or all of us. We can't do anything. And Michonne. Crap. So that's it then. I don't think you realize how serious I am. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Just think of Michonne. If she's alive, this could buy her enough time to escape. Just think of her. Leave them for the biters. Let's roll before they get too close, before one of these shell shock fucks decide to fire a gun. Hurry! Move! Move! Billy! No! Drive! God damn it, drive! I don't... Oh God, I don't think I can do this. Doesn't matter, you have to. We've got to get it together, people. Or else Tari's just dying for nothing. Soon. Very soon these people are going to come over that hill again. And we have to be ready for them. Nobody's going to do this for us. Well, uh, how did it go? How did it go? It didn't go well, that's how. It didn't fucking work. We tried to get them to open the gates. Trade their man for access inside. We even threatened the man's life. These crazy, evil sons of bitches shot their own man. We had a bit of leverage, and so they shot their own guy in the fucking head. They killed him, so we couldn't use him against them. So what do we do now? What do we do? We fucking kill every last one of them. That's what we do. No more waiting. No more stalling. It's time to finish this. We move now. Get in your cars, load up your fucking guns, and let's move. We're taking these monsters down. Ridding the world of their evil. Right here, right now. Let's get moving, people. What the hell is your problem? Fuck. <laughs>